when the devil wants to frustrate a family, if you want to frustrate a family finance, he will first of all bring katakata into that family. Immediately, husband and wife no longer look at each other. And the children are not in agreement with the parents. He has penetrated. You people will be praying and praying and praying and praying. You will not see results because there is no agreement. There is no agreement. It's one weapon that the devil is using against believers. And many of us are ignorant about this. If only we could know this, we would do everything we can do to keep peace. We would do everything we can do to love one another. We would do everything we can do to be united because there is power in unity. Am I provoking anybody here? We are talking about progress. These are keys to progress. Prayer is not the only key to progress. Fasting is not the only key to progress. Deliverance, minor things that we look down on, we don't look, we don't walk on them, but they have a lot to do in our Christian life, in our receiving blessings. And as we know this truth today, I will begin to adjust, I will begin to correct ourselves, I begin to do what is right, we shall harvest greatly. Oh, 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 we shall invest greatly in the name of Jesus. The devil is an author of confusion. He brings in confusion in order to scatter us. He brings in confusion so that we can lose focus. In minute there's confusion, there's katakata, there's disagreement, there's quarreling, there's fighting. We will lose focus on the main thing. And we have main thing that we are pursuing. We are pursuing something. We are not just on this earth. We are here on a mission. We are here to represent God on earth. We are special. We are sent on a mission. And since we are sent on a mission, we have a project. We have a plan. There is something. There is an assignment. There is a program that God has put for us to do. Praise the Lord. We are on a mission. And how are we going to carry out this mission effectively? It is by staying focused. And how are we going to have this focus until we are united, until we have peace, until there is agreement? We will not be able to have that focus. Most of the quarreling and disagreement that come among us as believers, as children of the Most High God, the target is to hinder your progress. If you know this, after service, when somebody is trying to look for your word, I know go answer them. Many of us are so careless. Immediately we leave this place like that, we go home, we start quarreling. We start quarreling. Sometimes you need to, to give somebody your face so that they can slap. Jesus said, if they slap you one side, give them what? He said, that does not mean that you are a fool. No. You are trying to outsmart the devil. 